Hi right, guys, how's all doing? Hope you're all well, hope you're all blessed. Well, it's currently 5 o'clock in the morning, I'm just up, I'm getting ready, and I'm having a coffee. I smell the fresh air. That is what life is all about, okay? It's not all about fancy clothes, fancy cars, nothing like that. Life is life. People need to start learning to live life. Whatever you say on the internet or on YouTube, just remember, you will bump into that person one day on the street. Maybe you think you're okay behind a keyboard, shouting and giving people abuse. But you've got to remember, the UK is a small place. You will eventually bump into these people. That's why I don't understand when people go in there, shouting and bawling, calling each other out. It's just crap, you know what I mean? We've seen it now, happening in Carlisle. It's all coming out now. All coming out now, you know what I mean? And I said it all along, all along, I'll be back to 2018, when a certain individual started trolling me, started texting me, started Facebooking me, putting all these bad rumours out about me. You know what they are? Where are they? It just shows YouTube is a funny old world and a waste of talent, you know what I mean? For what? Ego. Egoistic people who think that they're above certain individuals, then they're not. And I do believe over the next couple of weeks we will see more of this coming out and shouted out about this certain individual. And it's called karma. You can't expect to go in on people or talk about people, create rumours, lies, and nothing come back. Doesn't work that way. Doesn't work that way. But let's see what happens in the next couple of weeks. You know what I mean? Anyway, guys, stay safe and stay blessed. And realistically, what was it all for? What was it all for? That's what people need to ask themselves. What was all that for? Because they've all just dumped each other. You know what I mean? That just shows you how wicked YouTube is, how evil it is, how jealous people get people's views, subs. If you're worried about views, subs, and everybody recognising you in the street, then that's egoistic. Right? That's because you were a nobody at the start. And that's what it is. And you want to be famous. You crave the fame. You know what I mean? Hold it. And look at it, it's a way. Back to YouTube, creating crap, talking crap. But that's just the way it goes on YouTube. You know what I mean? That's just the way it goes. Now, I'm not afraid to be some kind of mad fighter, but at the end of the day, I'm trying with my channel. I know where I'm going with my channel. But you look at half of these channels and you're like, oh, who would even these cunts have a fucking time of day, man? You know what I mean? They talk shite. They're meant to be God's men. They're meant to be this. They're meant to be that. And all the day, they just create shite. I don't get it. I don't get it. You know what I mean? But it's eventually coming out now. Now I know who was behind. I knew anyway. But now I know definitely 100% who was behind it all. Sad, sad world. It's a funny world, but it's sad. You know what I mean? <coughs> <coughs> I can sleep in my bed at night. Easy. Not a problem. I don't need to worry about anybody coming in my door. And that's what I always say to people. If you want to start an internet beef, or chew, or whatever you want to call it, then you expect the backlash if it's going to come. Because people don't forget things. They don't forget things. And, you know what I mean? And that's the reality. Once you fall out with a certain individual, they'll cause a lot of trouble for you. And you can't even moan about it, because you put yourself in that situation. You put yourself on YouTube. You know what I mean? So, you put yourself out there. You know, if somebody's got an opinion, I get it all the time. I have no got this and I have no... What can you go fuck? I don't need to prove nothing to nobody. You know what I mean? The only people I need to prove things to is my boy and my family. You don't need to prove nothing to nobody. I don't know who am I. But did he? No. 
they're most in the world are fantasists and simple preaching they're clean preaching they're this preaching they're that they're not clean they're not nothing they're just an individual that had a chance and blew it for what fame ego you got a lot of them on youtube you see it all the time you know what i mean and it all stems back to the cd fight club and they were all in 3D Fight Club and they were all this and they were all that. Where are they all now? Where are they all now? Do you know what I mean? And that's the truth of YouTube. You'll get used, you'll get abused. And that's all for clicks and views. It's not worth it. Do you know what I mean? You've got to remember your family, your friends, your kids. They're all going to look at this. And years to come and go, ah, oh, what was my dad thinking about? What's my dad thinking about, man? You know what I mean? Fucking embarrassing. You know what I mean? And what's it all for? Ego? Money? I'd rather sit with nothing, to watch it. And just sit and hold that burden on my shoulder. Because that is fucking terrible. That's mental. Why would you put yourself through that? For what? To be known. To be famous. You're not going to be famous. You know what I mean? You had your chance. You just blew it. I mean, they all blew it. You know what I mean? But they sit and they come on and they moan. I bet this and that. No. You blew it. You got the chance. You fucked it. Couldn't you stay away from it? But you blame everybody else? No. No. And all these cunts that's kidding on it that are clean and they're after this and they're after that. Come on, man. You just need to fuck it. Look at them, man. You know what I mean? It's, it's terrible. But as I say, YouTube likes drama. And drama gets you. Yes. If you want to make a cunt yourself for views, then that just says a lot about your personality and dignity. You know what I mean? You've got cunts jumping about with watches that didn't even fit them, fucking wrapped up to the, to the whatever. You know what I mean? But these people are meant to walk about their towns and their centres with no problem at all. But they're all wrapped up and drowning about and hiding here, hiding there. You never seen them walk about the high street. You never seen them do nothing like that. You never seen them walk about anywhere. They're always in a car or they're in the house. You know what I mean? But you never seen them walk about the streets. You never seen them talk about the high street or nothing. You know what I mean? I don't get it. I don't get it. Anyway, folks. Have a good day. Stay blessed. And stay well. You know what I mean? I had a wee bit of cold there. I'm back. Feeling fine. But... As I say, folks, let's get old money. Get our grip, sir. You know what I mean? Ninnies are important. Ninnies are important, man. These are uh, irrelevant, man. These are just fucking daydreamers, man. And, you know what I'm talking about? Daydreamers. I can remember this going back to 2018. And it's still going on. You know what I mean? Come on, man. Get a grip, sir. <laughs> anyway, folks, stay safe, stay lucky, stay blessed. And it's just one of these things, man. Eh? You can't educate wood, and that is it. Okay, stay safe, stay blessed. Bye-bye.